What's up guys? Today we are watching episode 6 of Wolf Pack. So, last episode, the group went to a pool party thing and everything was fine and dandy until the wolf actually showed up and I was kind of surprised by that because it's like, I didn't think it would want to show its face or whatever to so many people, but it did. And I'm kind of confused as to why, but oh well. But at the end of the episode, whenever the cop lady and security guard were looking in this like building, they found where the wolf was keeping like the dead bodies and shit. And then the lady ended up killing the security guard. And I was so confused because it's like, why? Does that mean like she knows who the wolf is or is she a wolf? But it's like, I don't want to assume she's a wolf because I feel like she would have been able to find it herself with her senses. But then again, it's like in this world, you have to like be with the pack to have like your senses or something like that. You know, like it's weird. But I want to, I want my questions answered in this episode. Hopefully everything's answered in this episode. Well, you know, not everything, but most stuff. But yeah, let's get into the episode. Right where? The pool. There's nothing in the pool. It's not in the pool anymore. It's right outside. I mean, y'all all saw it too. Wasn't the bitch coming out the water? Like, y'all saw it. <laughs> he got some good eyesight, because I didn't see that. Was that? I told you it's out there. There's something out there. No, no, no. It's just a possum. Okay, stop trying to scare the shit out of everyone. Possum. It had dark fur and its eyes. How the fuck would that be a possum? That's a big ass possum. If that's the case, like. Are you okay? I can't remember my name. Okay, how much did you take? Um. Is that because of the shrooms? Like, turn the light off. They're still lighting that hoe. What do you think that was gonna do? Maybe it has night vision or something like that. She could see you in its colored eyes. Maybe, I'm guessing. Fuck this. I'm leaving. Go for it. Nobody here knows you anyways. You petty. You weird. But I get it because you like Harlan. He ain't gonna get snatched. I thought you were leaving. Is the possum going to kill us? No. It's not a fucking possum. Period. Like it's not. Why do you why does everyone keep saying that it is? Like that's once not that big. Tell him. Tell them what? You can't just tell everyone everything. So I'm assuming you're not just gonna tell them all of that, but at least like part of the truth, I guess. It's for that guard to come back. Still couldn't find the key. Don't worry, we can go back later. Jang found something in Cyrus's room. I think I need to get over here. It's hard to tell if she's trustworthy or not, because she had to have a reason to do that. And it's like, why? It killed a cop, it killed my nurse and a doctor. It's, it's killing people every night. Say it. I'm sorry, that just kind of sounded like the Edward moment from Twilight. Even more right now, I'm sorry. Werewolf. It was a bear, a black bear. 
you gave partial truth, just, you know. The blonde haired kid, the, the really quiet one, where'd he go? Who are you talking about? The guy who was standing right behind me, he was really high, he could barely remember his name. That's not high, that's brain damage. Oh, so no one else saw him? I'm coming with you to protect me from the rabid bear. If you get killed, how are we supposed to go on a date? That's cute. Okay. You're also going to just protect him. So I feel that. I thought... I thought you were going to tell them all the truth. I couldn't. How much of the truth... How much of the truth can you tell them? Oh. Sorry. You're not sorry. You're not gonna go off on her or something? Why do you hate me so much? What do you mean? You're the one going off at her. About a year ago, my dad came to me with my mom's phone and asked me to unlock it. I told him I didn't know her password. But he knew I was lying. Did he find some shit? I watch him find all these messages from some guy named Rob. Your mom was cheating on him? She was cheating. Turned to complete shit. All because of a fucking phone. So that made her not like it. She didn't tell you because it just... It just happened. Like, what's going to make her want to tell that to other people? What about the one at your back? Personal. Is that the gun for, like, the silver bullets or something? Premises. You got a warrant? Your eyes are pretty dilated there, young lady. Have you been smoking or consuming a list of substances? No, just... How does that... How does that prove anything? Because my eyes get dilated when I take my meds. So you can't exactly do that. It's here. What? It's on the ground. Outside the backyard. It's here. At least we got dude there so he could also help. I'm glad that the dad dude is there. Something out here. I think we should go back. Okay, one thing first. Okay. Smooth. Now who's gonna find you back there? All right, we can go back. One sec. I thought that ruined the moment, but he thought he heard someone, so. What do you mean? You and me. I mean, if you really like me, oh my god, it's not a problem. <sighs> your friends don't like me. Who cares? They're not gonna accept me as part of your pack. Well, you also seem kind of petty, and why'd you call it a pack? Pack. Yeah, I think they kind of see me as a, a threat. It's so weird that he randomly said pack, like... Cyrus, get back. What the fuck is that? Tell me that is a possum again, once you see that. You see it? I see it. Harlan, run. They look like they ran forward. Like... Get away! But at least you stood up to it and tried to shoot it. So I guess it's not on its team. I'm not here to hurt you. Not if I don't have to. So you trying to befriend this bitch. I can help you. You don't have to stay like this. Is she talking about turning it back to human? Help 
That's the first time you spoke English. Good shot. Hell yeah. But it still ran away. But it's like, why? You didn't even do anything to it. You just had your gun to defend yourself. It just looked at you and wanted to kill you. Where's Harlan? I'm making sure they don't arrest. Oh, dude. Why did you block your number? What is this about? Tell me why you blocked your number. He got to think it's him. You blocked your number because you were getting calls from a blocked number. Yeah. I mean, all it said was no call. The same dude that was calling them? It was some guy asking about my father. He said he knew what really happened and, and how my father really died. Did he tell you? The hell? Say that again. I'm not an arsonist. Say it again. He's trying to see if he could hear his heartbeat to see if he's lying. I'm not an arsonist. So he's telling the truth. Or he knows how to control his heartbeat. That's what a keg stand. We used to do those back in college. I was pretty good at him, actually. His dad seems much more laid back with shit, so I like him. That's good to hear. Especially since you haven't been taking your medication. Yes, I have. No, you haven't. How do you know? Still count your pills. You're not feeling any side effects? Why would you count his pills? Well, you remember what happens. Yeah. I remember. Um, that's scary. What happens? Apparently not something good. That looks like an evil stare, okay? It's like, it kind of seems like he is getting better. But also, you know, kind of not. I don't know. I'll tell you if you really want to know. You don't have to tell me anything. He's respectful like that. I don't need a phone to find you. That is so sweet. And now the kiss. Okay. Oh no, is she gonna be the next one dead? I just had a feeling that she would be. Turn around. And she's dead. Her and Blake just made up too. Like, what the fuck? Imagine just waking up and seeing that, like... Did you get a good look at it? Not really. 
It was pretty dark. Y'all are both liars. But for different reasons, too. And I just want to know her reason. Just an animal. You're like every other animal in those woods. We can hunt it. And we can kill it. And she doesn't want to do that. Well, they never actually found the bodies. And you know what happens when they don't find the bodies? Conspiracy theories. I've had crazy assholes calling me. Well, like they haven't found the bodies of like the other people. So it's like, what if the wolf did kill his dad? I don't know. The fire didn't kill my dad and the rest of the hotshot crew. What did? A wolf. That's what I was saying. Smart. Hanging out with a number one arson suspect? Or going to a party with a girl who's now missing? Or how about Officer Trent Miller's car being found right around the corner of your house? Everyone's getting an attitude this episode with this man. And you know what? They gotta watch their fucking attitude. I don't know what you're talking about. A crew died in a fire. I know it might sound crazy, but that sometimes happens to firefighters. Gideon Emery, are you kidding me? Mr. Ducalion himself? Okay. I'm happy now. What kind of wolf was it? How about all you fuck off? Let me do my job. Was it a gray wolf? What if, plot twist, he's the wolf? I don't know why, but I'm just saying, maybe he can turn back into human. Maybe he doesn't need the other lady's help. I don't know. Garrett, what did you see? Something that changes everything. What? I want to know. What was it? Because I saw a dude too. You can feel the heat at our backs. Path to the ridge and the only way out. Behind that wolf. It's so weird how he was the only one that made it out, though. Some of us also carried handguns. I fired off a couple rounds to scare it, but the thing didn't even flinch. Because why would it be scared of bullets that can't even hurt it that much? If you had silver bullets, that would have been different. When we came over to push the body out of the way, we, we saw the thing was still breathing. Shit, so it like sneak attacked in a way. Watch the flames take over. That's when it died? No. That's when it changed. If it died, it wouldn't have been alive right now. The wolf started to stand up on his hind legs, which all of a sudden were twice as long. Imagine witnessing that. Like, that's fucking terrifying. He's saying the fire turned the wolf into a werewolf. But it was already a wolf, but then it turned into like a stronger one. Who killed the hotshot crew? That wasn't the only wolf we saw in the woods. There was another one. So there's two. So who's the other one? Did you start the fires? No. I believe you. But there are some people who don't. You're gonna have to convince them. I swear, he's the best character. That's why I didn't let you and the rest of the crew through the trail. Right. Where was the rest of the pack? Oh, so there was a pack. Strange thing is, 
think the animal knew it too because it came right for us. So that means the mom isn't dead either. So then where's the mom? Is it the lady? Garrett found you in that same fire 17 years ago. Yeah, we know. The hotshot crew killed your mother, but your father killed the crew. And then like 10 years later, you're in the middle of the woods and you see your father. Oh, so the mom did die. So never mind. What if that's why he set the fire? Not just to draw the wolf out of the woods, but to change it. To transform it into the werewolf killing everyone right now. That kind of makes sense. Okay. With Ramsey. In jail. In a juvenile detention center. Then in court. Where he'll get a chance to explain his side of the story. <laughs> you fuck! Damn, Harlan. Why would you do that knowing that you have a little bit more strength than usual? They all turning up on his ass. Leave him alone. He was just trying to help. Remember, Harlan. <sighs> Damn, so it's like he upset Harlan and then the whole pack was going at him. And he was able to bring him back, so. Harlan. You know who you are. You're my son. Best character, hands down. The wolf you saw in the woods as a boy. And the thing you saw last night. It's not your father. So it's not the dad, it was the kid. What? His name is Baron. How do you know that? I have no idea. Cause he never said it to you. So how the hell did you know? Her brother. Baron. So, you, their brother? You know, that just makes things so much more complicated to think about now because it's like now they know that that's not their dad. But then also, it's like it would have made more sense if it was the dad. And it's like, okay, so he didn't tell cop lady who it was, like, as he should because she kind of seems. I don't know. Like, I don't know what's up with her. But it's like she wanted to help it. Not saying that she shouldn't, but it's like, help him control it, I guess. But it's like, how would she know how to control it? That has to mean that she's some kind of wolf. Because, again, how would she know? I don't know. It's, like, so confusing, but then also not. And it's so weird how Cyrus is kind of, like, connected to all this. Like, literally, his dad died in a fire, and apparently it was from a wolf. So that wolf was obviously, like, Harlan and Luna's parents. Because they killed the uh, mom and then, you know, other one got away or something. But it's like, they got us thinking that the dad was going to show up any amount of time throughout the show. And then he didn't. And I'm kind of mad because it's like, I wanted to see the dad. I wanted to see that dad and then new dad tough it out. I don't know. Like... I just want to know like how that would have went like if they did get to see their father again like it would have been so weird but then again it's kind of like maybe maybe that wasn't their dad because yeah they were found in the same fire but it's like I don't know it has to be because I mean what other wolves were out there that time because I mean well actually there was a pack of them so maybe it wasn't I don't know I'm confusing myself even more just thinking so like deep into it. 
But you know what? I am so happy Gideon and Emery showed up in this episode. Like, that made me... Oh, I love that man. I loved watching him play Deucalion and Teen Wolf. He portrayed him so fucking well. He was a top-tier character in that show. Everyone loved that man. I was so fucking happy to see him in this episode. I did not expect to freaking see him. Like, yeah, there's been, like, a few crossovers. But him? Like, okay. Like, I love that. I love that he's in that. And hopefully he's back in, like, the other, like, the next two episodes. Because I think there's only two episodes left. But that is so, like, cool but weird. And, you know, like I was thinking earlier... I don't know why I automatically thought that maybe he was the wolf from a long time ago. Because it's like, maybe he is, but maybe not. Because he, se he seemed like he was telling the truth. But I don't know. Because I still find it weird that he was like the only one to survive. And it's like, a few times whenever I see that kind of shit happens, it's because that is who the person like is. And actually what I'm basing that off of is Criminal Minds in like season five, okay? <sighs> with the Zodiac Killer. Fuck. I need to stop thinking about other shows. Okay. So, love that man was back in this episode. He's been in some other shit that I've seen, and I was, like, so surprised to see him in them. Like, I, th I think he was in either, it was, like, an episode of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. or The Rookie or something. Like, I remember seeing him play, like, a guard in something. And I just can't figure it out right now. But that's not the point. I'm kind of mad that dude let Sheriff Lady take Cyrus. Because yeah, like what if he can't defend himself and then he just ends up in jail anyway because they don't believe him. Like you kind of messed it up for him at that point. Like you should have gave him like a little bit more time to get his like shit together. So he would like know what to say even though he is like he's not guilty. He's innocent. But you still gotta let him build that story so he can prove himself. And he didn't get enough time to. Unless, like, you just helped him, like, then and there before you send him. But hopefully, he doesn't end up in jail. Or, like, for long, you know? And, you know, I'm still kind of surprised that the other girl died this episode. Like, I thought she was gonna die in, like, one of the later episodes. Or, like, earlier ones. But she didn't. And it was actually this episode. And I just didn't see the point to it. Because, like, yeah, I kind of wanted her dead at first because she was kind of aggravating me because of, like, the way she was acting with Blake. But they made up this episode. And what happens right after? Bam. Dead. Blows me with how that shit is. But we still don't even know who the dude is on the phone. Because apparently, you know, Cyrus, too, was getting calls from the other dude. Who is it? Tell me who it is. Mm. I'm mad that I don't know, but I'm still kind of surprised that we do know now, like, who the actual wolf is. Like, I didn't think that they would, like, reveal it in this episode. I thought it was good. It would be, like, a season finale type shit, but it's not. I still have, like, what, two episodes to go. So, I need to see more of what's going to happen in this shit. I need to see more with, like, that sheriff lady and what she has to do with some of this stuff. So, I guess, come back for episode seven. <laughs> 